Bubbles. Oh, there's the collector. Hello, everyone. What is that face? I don't know. <laughs> Get a new one. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the Pumpkin Patch, and welcome to another episode of Haunt Story in here on Days of Halloween as we go out to another haunted house in the southeast. But uh, are we going to a local haunt? No, we're not. Are, are we going to a uh, theme park haunt? No. No. Oh, well, then we must be going to Netherworld Haunted House. We are really looking forward to what Netherworld has in store for us this year. Uh, we have been coming to Netherworld for quite a while, uh, and we love it. We think it is the best haunted house in the entire country. Uh, hands down, ah. not even close. Um, if you're a haunt, you want to be like Netherworld, clearly, and you should. Mm -hmm. uh, but we are going to show you what it's like here at Netherworld, show you a little bit of the midway, show you some of the shopping, showing some of the fun. Uh, but ride with us here, Fall Horseman. Get a new face. Here we go. Yeah. We're across the street at the parking lot. Crossing over now. Netherworld is slammed tonight. Luckily, they have time tickets, so your weight is a little bit different. Going that way. Have tickets, need tickets. Have tickets, need tickets. Well, if you need tickets, you're in trouble. So they split you up into two different directions when you get here. The people that do have tickets already, which you purchase online, and the people that need tickets that way. Uh, people need tickets tonight, they're in trouble because uh, they already told us in the parking lot they're sold out through 11 o'clock. Uh, so if you're here and you want to go to Netherworld, uh, you might want to leave and come back, but get your tickets early because uh, that's the secret. Welcome to Netherworld. So you see they got the uh, fast pass entrance and then the timed entry right down there. Netherworld is located in Stone Mountain, Georgia. They used to be in Atlanta, uh, actually in Norcross, uh, but they've been moved here for a couple of years. Uh, the building is massive. Uh, the attraction is huge. Uh, and the quality is second to none. Netherworld is one of the top haunted attractions rated by everyone. Uh, not just us. Uh, we don't, don't just take our word for it. Uh, it is an amazing haunted house that has amazing attention to detail, wonderful characters, and honestly, just they're very inventive. They do things differently here at Netherworld. It shows and it pays off. Uh, it's worth every penny to come to Netherworld. In fact, we try to come to Netherworld as many times as we possibly can because it's such an amazing experience and it's different every single year. They break down and rebuild the haunt every single time. It is amazing and we are so happy to be within a couple hours drive from it and we try to come as often as possible. I'm ready whenever y'all are. We got everybody? You're good to go, yeah. All right. Let's go. Just head on in. <laughs> Too sweet. Too sweet. Too sweet. Too sweet. Too sweet it up. Too sweet me, bro. Too sweet me. Mainstay from Netherworld for many, many years. Now he's a wonderful photo op and he greets you here when you're standing in line. And uh, over here we have a picture of the collector. And over there we have a picture of the mangler. Uh, the mangler and the collector are icons of Netherworld haunted attraction. Uh, they no longer like host the haunts themselves. Uh, they're usually able to be uh, seen walking around. Thank <laughs> you. 
if this sign or Rocky himself over here look familiar, uh, these particular items were used as props in the film Hellfest, uh, which came out a couple of years ago. Uh, it's set at a haunted attraction. It was shot outside of Atlanta. Uh, and Netherworld provided quite a lot of the props. Uh, Netherworld has a lot of different places that you can stop in and eat at. Uh, little food booths, little uh, food trucks and whatnot. Uh, this particular one right now is closed. It's right here in the line to get in. Uh, but if you look over here in the distance, I don't know if I can really get a good shot of it. Uh, that does a good breakdown on uh, when you can actually enter. All tickets to Netherworld are timed, uh, and you just uh, buy the time that works out best for you or the time that's left available, because uh, Netherworld is quite the popular attraction. So tonight, uh, for tonight's uh, attraction here, it's going to be me, myself, uh, Mr. JT Wheatley, my beautiful wife, Jessica. We have Jeff. We have Hunter, we have his girlfriend, we have Eric, we have Star, somewhere in there. Uh, we have Chris and Tina. Hey, everybody! Hey, everybody! Uh, so that's the crew. Uh, we're standing in line right now for the attraction. We're about to actually turn around the corner. We're gonna scan our tickets, go through the attraction. We'll let you know our thoughts a little bit later. But once we get out, we're gonna show you uh, a bit of the midway. Uh, and there are two attractions here at Netherworld. There is the, uh, the main attraction, uh, which is called the Undying Horror this year. And then there is the uh, what they call the basement show, and that's going to be the uh, the second haunt. And I believe that one's called Parasitic. Enjoyed it? I loved it. It's my favorite Netherworld experience. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's my favorite. It's my favorite Netherworld experience I've ever had. It was amazing. I've been coming since like 2006, I think. And you're getting dressed for the How wonderful. <laughs> of course, of course. How could I not? At least somebody's in this area. I'm the only one. Oh. Right, right. <laughs> Welcome to the Midway at Netherworld. As soon as you exit the main haunt, which is where we came out through here, uh, the additional haunt, the secondary haunt, is going to be down this way. Uh, but they have this fantastic Midway for you to hang out. A lot of photo ops uh, where you can pick up your souvenir photos. Uh, they got drinks. They got donuts. Uh, just a ton of stuff. There's characters all through this area. Uh, there's a fantastic collection of everything. And then right behind us, is the gift shop. I think they wanted to be in the gift Dr. Octane uh, drinks the blue raspberry kind. Jessica tried it. It's good, I like it. You like it? Pretty good. It's really good, I like it. It does bubble. We're now headed to the uh, secondary haunt right now. Here we go. Parasitic. Your hat's glowing.
Now we're now in line for Parasitic, the basement haunt, as it's called. Got everybody ready here. We just got done with Parasitic. We'll walk around a little bit, uh, check out some of the Midway. Uh, fantastic shows all the way around. We'll do a better breakdown when we get out because, uh, you know, copyright music and everything. All the animatronics are just chilling out here. Look at all this. Huh? Yeah, they moved the caskets out now. They're all here, it looks like. Welcome to Netherworld. Oh, we have the Pumpkin Lord? Oh, the Pumpkin Lord? Is this the Pumpkin Lord's cousin? Tyrone Lord? Tyrone Pumpkin? Tyrone Pumpkin. Tyrone Pumpkins. Pumpkins. Yes. Then they have a uh, foam pit over here. But you can just kind of jump in wherever you want to. You don't have to, uh, you're not forced to go through it. However, if I know Jonathan, J if I know JT Wheatley, he's going to jump in this foam pit. They got wonderful photo ops up here. At the midway here. I, I really loved Netherworld this year. I thought it was amazing. Um, I really, I had a fantastic time. Love the Midway as always, but I, I especially love the main haunted house. I thought it was really well done this year. It was my favorite year ever at Netherworld. And um, I, just, I just really enjoyed it and had a good time as always at Netherworld. Um, can't wait to, uh, can't wait to see what they have in store next. I absolutely loved Netherworld this year. It was fantastic. The Top Haunt, the uh, Undying Horror, was probably the best that they've ever been on that main haunt. Uh, the Basement Haunt was okay. Um, felt a little like patchwork uh, as opposed to other years. Um, I liked it, uh, but I loved the Top Haunt. It was fantastic. I loved the, the new additions. The, the larger than life sets were fantastic. Uh, it is a wonderful haunted house. Uh, get down to Stone Mountain, Georgia and definitely hit this haunt. If you love haunted houses, go do it. If you love like theme park type things, go do it. This is like Halloween Horror Nights to the 25th level. I absolutely adore Netherworld. I cannot recommend it enough. Yeah, another fantastic year at Netherworld. Fantastic uh, main haunt. Uh, fantastic Great Midway, of course, the main haunt has some fantastic animatronics, jump scares. Vortex Town, the nearly killed James as usual. That's so you know it's a good one. And of course, uh, the parasitic, the the bottom, the basement haunt, not as fun, but hey, for the whole, whole ticket price, definitely worth checking out. And gotta love the foam pit. But yeah, great, another great weekend there. We'll definitely come down if you're ever in the area. This is actually my second Netherworld. Came for the first time last year uh, with the Fall Horseman. Um, had a great time that I as I expected to. Um, this is really the Super Bowl of haunted houses. If you if you ask me from what I hear, I'm, I'm not really a haunted house person, but everybody says it is, and I believe it. Um, but uh, yeah, come out to Netherworld if you're in the uh, Atlanta area, and um, have a good time and get uh, totally scared. 
Netherworld this year is one of the best it's ever been. The main haunt is totally great. Wasn't as many, wasn't, wasn't as many scare actors, but totally great. Um, with one of the only houses I've ever been to is being Universal. It's one of the better, lo more local and closer haunts, and also more affordable ones. And for even it being really affordable, it's one of the best ones I think I've ever been to. Really love going to Netherworld, always our favorite. I think this year they've changed a lot of things around, added some new stuff. The characters are always great, the set is always awesome. Netherworld 22, 2022 was awesome, as always. Netherworld 2022, third year in a row. They brought it again with the buffet of fear. There's something for everybody. You like characters, there's characters. You like animatronics, you, there's animatronics. There's a cemetery, there's gore. There's my personal favorites, a giant bear, a giant shark, and a werewolf. I like it. Big crowd, short wait, tamped, uh, time stamped entry is a good thing. Get there early and let's do the time warp again. Thank you for watching this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, make sure that you like, share, subscribe. Uh, that's where you click or treat. Um, stock us on all the social media sites and come on down to Netherworld because they're fantastic. And uh, from all the fall horsemen here, uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for riding with the fall horsemen where Halloween lives. And fall is forever. The Laparka dance. I don't, know what, I don't remember what that is. Do you not remember the Laparka dance? Like the Pee Wee Herman dance? Sort of like that, yeah. Like the. <laughs> 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 <laughs>